What is going on all of you sexy, gorgeous, beautiful, wonderful gaming legends out there? My name is Tyler, aka Deathly, and I can't tell if my webcam is boned right now. So let's see. Mm, Autofocus is on. See? That was the big problem. Right there. All right. Cool. So, hi, everybody. Uh, bit of a su suspense. Do you, since I'm going to be wearing a different shirt in the battle video, did I record the intro first or did I do the battle first and then record the intro later? I can't even remember if I said what the order was. But anyway, this is the team that we're going up against. It's week five of APA. This is going to be the brand new draft. Ow. I definitely did not just accidentally punch myself in the. Mm. So. Oh. This is why you don't drink and commentate, people. Um, anyway, we're going to go ahead and talk about my team here. Uh, we were going up against Ben, a.k.a. General Tar Heel, coach of the Charlotte Charizards. Um, and this is the team I thought he was going to bring. I think he's going to bring. Uh, in addition to, he has Togedemaru, Kecleon, Comfe, Azelf, and Greninja available to bring to counter my team i think this was the best possible solution uh hopefully you guys are excited for some of the members of the team here um we have nato king heatran tornado suicune mega manetric bulu and uh we're gonna go ahead and dive into the summary here so scarf nato king i could have gone life orb but i wanted to have the opportunity to outspeed some things and i know rocks and speed are not the best combo in terms of scarf rocks, but um, I just figured if I had the opportunity to put the stealth rocks out and a free pass, we were gonna do it and we we're gonna swap out. But sheer force, life scar or choice scarf, EP, fire blast, ice beam, and the rocks uh, pretty much offers general coverage that deals with most of his team and uh, helps hit things pretty hard. Next, we have our Torn T, threw an expert belt on it, Hurricane, U-Turn, Heat Wave, and Defog. As you can tell with the heat, I was really worried about Bronzong, as well as making sure I could deal with the Mega Venusaur, even though Hurricane hits pretty hard. I almost brought a Rain Dance set, just so my Thunders from Mega Manetric would hit hard, like, guaranteed hit, and then also the Hurricanes wouldn't miss. So, I was this close to bringing, like, Zorark with like illusion setting uh damp rock <laughs> rain dance just just for some shenanigans but maybe since we got three more weeks of this team we can have some fun with it um tapu bulu swords dance substitute horn leech and zen headbutt with a psychium z uh v mega venusaur terrifies me honestly like i ran it all of wbe i know how much of a threat it is as a pokemon uh it scares the hell out of me and it is so disgustingly good, especially when you add in abilities um, and just the fact that it's just gross. Like, no thank you. Um, then we have Heatran. Obviously, Bulu Heatran's like a combo that works relatively well. The Grassy Surge uh, prevents, uh, like, mitigates some of the ground damage that comes toward Bulu so he can safely come in. More often than not, uh, we ran Torment because I didn't want things to be able to hit me with an EQ twice, a.k.a. I think actually he has Lando T and not Lando Incarnate. So uh, let me go ahead and change that on the overlay. Um, But, like, Landorus couldn't hit me with two EQs. Like, I would have been fine with that. Uh, or at least two EQs in a row, rather. Uh, so we can just kind of get a free swap in. Uh, to like a Nitto King, and then um, drive him out from there. And then we have the um, Mega Manetric, T-Bolt, Volt Switch, Overheat. Obviously, my plan is to Volt Turn with Tornadus and Mega Manetric to hit as much chip damage and keep as much momentum going as physically possible. And then Suicune's just kind of there. As a sponge. I know I have sub on three different Pokemon. Please don't judge me. Okay. No, wait. We didn't put sub on. We almost put sub instead of protect on Heatran. but Or instead of torment. But I didn't want to do... I want, didn't want a toxic stall. But 
Like, that's Suicune. That's the team. Protect, Scald, Calm Mind, all that fun stuff. Uh, that's everything. So, um, without further ado, let's go ahead and get to the battle screen and wish me luck. I'll see y'all out on the battlefield. What is going on all of you gaming legends out there? My name is Tyler, aka Deathly, and this is going to be APA Week. Five. Are y'all ready to rumble? We're going up against the Carolina Charizards and my boy General Tar Heel. So, uh, hopefully you guys are excited. Ben and I are both currently three and one. So, woo, woo, woo. see how things play out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Um, is going to be a very interesting match. I'm excited. It's my brand new and Ben's first time as well with the second draft of APA. Um, so I've never used this team before, even though we're five weeks into this season. So we'll go ahead and see how things play out for us. All things considered, I always lose my stylist. I feel like I need one of those like, you know, how there's like those nerds that have like their glasses on a cord thing. I feel like I need that for my stylus. Like the Wii strap, but for my stylus. And it's like looped into my DS, so I never freaking lose this thing. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Interesting team. No Arcanine and no Landorus. So we're going with Comfey. Alrighty. Get to go up against Bronzong twice in a row. And we got Greninja as well. Ooh, God, a Greninja is such a sick shiny. Um, honestly, this looks extremely winnable for us. Um, without any... I think we lead Mega Manetric. I get mega early. And I can just freely Volt Switch out. So, yeah. I was really worried. The other Mons, like, I was really worried about a Zelf for sure. But uh, this looks great. This looks great. Do, 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 do. Man, Etric. We do not have a Lando T. That's a Greninja. Not proteined. Do, 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 do. And he is going to lead his Bronzong out of the gate here. Okay. Well, I am definitely okay with that. Let's take a look. I just need to swap out Arcanine for Comfey. Beautiful. All right. So, our Mega Manetric versus Bronzong. We're going to go ahead and Mega Evolve and fire off an Overheat right away. Hopefully, he swaps in. I think he's trying to get rocks up early. Not that my team is super affected by rocks. Plus, we have uh, Prankster... Tornado, so he can come in on something that revenge kills it and just really does deal with it. Um, there isn't much Bronzong can do to me, at least as far as I'm aware, but we'll see. I could be completely wrong. There's the Intimidate. And the Overheat. Wow, that did like nothing! Okay, so you are extremely special. Especially defensive. I'm so confused because I don't understand what set of circumstances that doesn't do more. I mean, that's like max HP, max special defense. Am I missing? No, I imported my showdown sets. Yeah, I don't know. That 
I'm so confused as to why that didn't do more. But I'll deal with it. Yeah, because overheat should have... Oh, I suppose if he's heat proof over... Hang on. There we go. That makes more sense. There's the... That's what we got. <laughs> I was like, what is missing here? But my boy's heat proof, so... Smart plays. But at least that means if I get my own rocks up, he's going to take damage every time he comes in. Not that he's going to take a lot because he's steel. But it is still good to know that I can rock an EQ on this Bronzong early. All right, there's the Volt Switch. Back to Trap Master. <laughs> there's the Psychic. Did like literally nothing. I want to see what he does. He should swap out here, and I'm hoping he goes Vaporeon or Greninja. Either way, I'd love for one of them to catch a Toxic in the face. Because that's pretty much free for me. And I'd be super, super happy about it. He withdraws! Yes! And you go into Vaporeon, who's going to catch a Toxic. Perfect. Vaporeon is badly poisoned versus Heatran. Yeah, depending on how it's built, could do a lot. All right, we're going to go right into Manetric. Do, 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 do. Let's see, he's going to heal. And that's going to give me a free switch in. Or we just go Suicune. Because it can sit in front of this thing all day. And we're going to go Manetric. Might as well. There's not much he can do. Unless he goes for the heal bell here. Alright, so on Bronzong, I've seen Stealth Rock, and I've seen Psychic. Wow! That is a big, big Vaporeon. That's, that's about as offensive as it gets. Holy God. Goodness, that did a lot of damage. Alright, um, I can pretty freely T-Bolt here. I probably should have Volt switched out, but I think he's going to leave. He withdraws. Okay, so I at least get the T-Bolt off. He goes into... There we go. Nice, and I can get another one of those. Or I can Volt Switch out. Mm, I'm trying to remember if Volt Switch did enough to the Bronzong. Yes, it should. Nope, hang on. Mega, Manetric. Yes, he is. That's 25%. Volt Switch should, in theory, 24. Oh my god, if this doesn't kill, I'm going to be so mad. It's like 24.1%. It does. Okay, sweet. Way to go. Manetric. Wonderful, wonderful start. So, 
Um, that takes Bronzong off the board. He's got rocks up currently. Um, his next move should be... Let me look and see who benefits the most from being out right now. I would honestly say... Nitto King does. Because I am scarfed. Let me look at... I got plenty of time. Okay. Nitto King, Scarfed, not too great against Vaporeon, no, I think I hold Nitto King back, yeah, we're holding Nitto King back, um, I think we go Boo then, bringing my boy Boo, Tapu Boo, there's the Grassy Surge, He should go Venusaur here. But that gets me a free Heatran out if he goes for the Sludge Bomb. Nope, that's Comfey. I want Tapu Boo on this side. Boo-Lu! All right, Boo-Lu. Lucky Roo is Venusaur. Okay, so. Mega Venusaur versus Tapu Bulu. Sludge Bomb absolutely decimates me. A Zen Headbutt does a lot of damage. And I'm going to try... I'm going to try to get the... the... Oh, wait a second. Ah, baby. Let's do it. Why the hell not? Why the hell not? <laughs> He withdraws. Who do you go into? Luffy is... Oh, no! Wow. Well baited. Well baited. Dang it. Wow. Nice job, Ben. Oh, my God. What a play. Zero damage whatsoever. Zero damage whatsoever. Um... I think he goes for the Ice Beam here. I'm going to go for a Horn Leech. I should have gone for the sub. That's what I wanted to do. I was like, I could sub thinking he's going to swap out, but I 100% thought he would at least go into Terrakion and not eat the Shattered Psyche. That was so smart, dude. I should have subbed. I should have subbed. Subbed? If I had subbed, like, this game would 100% be over. But now I got to claw back. Not that I have to claw back, but he put himself in a more advantageous position than previously. Um... Something takes big damage to Horn Leech. There's Gunk Shot. Oh! Oh, I am so sorry. That's so unfortunate. That is so unfortunate. Gunk Shot would have absolutely killed. That's... Oh, I am so sorry, Ben. You played that perfectly. That was well set, orchestrated, everything. And you just... Oh, Greninja let you down. But you did burn the Shattered Psyche, so props on that. Um, Bulu, I still need for Terrakion. Actually, I have Vaporeon. Or, I have, uh... I have a lot for the Terrakion still. So, I'm actually okay. So, you're gonna bring in your Venusaur now. Um... I think I'm gonna try to get behind a sub. And if he tosses a Sludge Bomb, I'm just gonna... Um... Zen headbutt. So he stayed in. Just curious what he goes for here. I get the sub off. You gonna go for Leech Seed? Sludge Bomb. Okay. So I'm gonna sack my Bulu here. Potentially. Could I go Heatran? So if he has Earth Power... Heatran takes about 60%. I will not outspeed his Venusaur as my Heatran is currently. Wow, that boy is bulky. Okay, you know what? We're gonna get the Zen Headbutt off. I don't care. I'll I'll take the law. I'll take the the death. Just to put him in some big damage. There's another Sludge Bomb. All right, so I'm sacking that. Then we're gonna bring in Nitto King.
There goes the Grassy Surge. Actually, I'm going to bring in Tornadus. What the hell am I talking about? Tornadus, please. Thank you. We can take some damage from the rocks. Let's take Bulu off. You did a good job, buddy. I mean, I probably wasted you. I could have swapped in Nidoking King to eat the Sludge Bomb, and we would have been fine. Hurricane should be super good for us. Especially if it hits the Vaporeon here. Tornadus. Good damage on the Vaporeon. Even if he has an Ice Beam, it doesn't kill. These rocks are going to start getting annoying. And he doesn't have a way to bring him back up. So, honestly, I'm thinking I'm going to get rid of the rocks. We're going to Defog. Then we're going to U-Turn. gonna get rid of the rocks then we can you turn into Manetric. is sludge bomb physical i should know this i ran vape no sludge bomb special okay i was gonna say like would intimidate be a good thing to throw on but no would not be indeed would be a no bueno move all right there's the defog that's huge Hopefully he uses like Heal Bell or something on himself. Scald, okay. Doesn't kill, and I don't get burned, which is great. Uh, that Toxic's starting to do a little bit more damage. All right, so fight, U-turn. And who can really eat a Scald on my team? Which is going to be Suicune. And that'll give me a chance to get behind a sub and start calm minding. I just don't want to get baited into a, wa a water absorb. Not when this thing's so close to dead. Use his wish. I mean, that's fine. You can wish all you want, buddy. Poison's still going to keep hitting you hard. Unless he wishes into freaking... Venus War just to get it some health back. Ooh, okay. So, Roar, Wish, Scald... Oh, that's bad. That's a bad day. Roar. All right, man. Metric. It's fine. This poison's doing so much to you at this point. And now I don't have the rocks to worry about, which is great. I'm just going to rip a T bolt. I'm sure it protects the last one, but in case it's not. Yeah, Manetric pretty much finishes this match. I mean, I still have to worry about Mega Venusaur still. And now that I don't have... I gotta make sure... Venusaur does not get healed by Vaporeon here. That's the key. I cannot let him wish into Mega Venusaur because it's our, I sacrificed Bulu to put him at half. I mean, I do still have the Heatran in the wings. So, but it's not like, a, I mean, an EP, he withdraws. Goes into Comfey. Moonface should take about half from that. He does, a little bit more than half. Now, Draining Kiss is going to do some damage here. Potentially could kill me as well. So, why don't we go into Nidoking? Ooh, 
would only give him 20%. He does also have Giga Drain access. I need to keep Manetric. Um, and since he is going to outspeed me... Actually, do we have Heatran? Looks even better. It's like, no. You get nothing from me, Comfey. Yeah, enjoy your, like, 3 HP, bro. <laughs> Come on, Heatran. I'm definitely in control of this battle. It's just a matter of, like, figuring out how to continue to break through the remaining Pokemon that he has. I mean, offensively, I have more health, more Pokemon, and better matchups against what he has remaining. The Vape Orion is toxic. The Venusaur is at half health. Comfey is under half as well. And then um, the Terrakion's at full. He hasn't brought it in yet. But I have plenty of answers for Terrakion. My Suicon Suicune can definitely handle it, um, as can uh, Scarf Nidoking. And uh, intimidate it down with Mega Manetric. So, if that's the last Pokemon that he has, I'll sack a couple of things just to uh, bring down its um, attack and uh, don't worry about it. So, Synthesis. Please just get the burn. So, we got Synthesis and Draining Kiss that we've seen so far. I will toss another Toxic. And then I'm going to Torment you. Because I'm not getting into this game. I did the same thing with uh, Panther's freaking Clefable, man. HP what? HP ground? HP ground. Holy God. Oh, you're life orbed? You madman. Alright, so he can't use HP twice in a row now. Uh, so we're gonna lava plume again. Since he's tormented. He withdraws. Who's catching a lava plume in the face? Please burn. Please burn Terrakion. Would make me so happy. No, we did not get the burn on Terrakion. Okay. I mean, I'm 100% die here. Um, I'm okay with sacking him. I think he's going to stay in. I'm, I just don't want to give him an opportunity to get a free sword stance off, so I'm going to sack Heatran here. Um... If he goes for a Swords Dance or Protect, like, I can at least try to mitigate that a little bit here. Or a Swords Dance or a uh, Substitute, rather. Close combat. Okay. So, you go right for the kill. That's fine. That's fine. Heatran dies. Your defense and special defense falls. So you are currently at minus one and minus one. Bring in Suicune. Actually, no. I don't want to. Not with... Yeah. I was going to bring in Nidoking, or um, Suicune, but not with Vaporeon still left alive. I really don't want to give a free Water Absorb off to... Alright, Nidoking. How are you looking versus everything else? Sixty percent. Nido King. 
Okay. All right. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world. I'm going to get one off here, depending on if he stays in or not. If he goes Venusaur, I'll just hit it twice with an EP. Um, if he goes Comfey, I'll hit it twice with an EP. Though, with its if it has Giga Drain, like, uh, I don't know. And it's not HP Fire, it's HP Ground. There we go. What do you decide to do, buddy? This is a very tough call. Down to a 4v4. I feel like I sacked Bulu unnecessarily. All right, sweet. Nitto King gets the kill here. That's Terrakion gone. That's a tab we can close out. Wonderful. Okay. We are looking really nice. We're going into Mega Venusaur. I do not want to give Mega Venusaur a chance to use... I've seen a sludge bomb, and that's pretty much it. <sighs> we could go... No, you know what? Nitto King's gonna stay in. I'm just gonna EP again. I really have no more use for him. Because if he dies, I just bring in tornadoes, and I just hit EQs. Or, um... Just hit hurricanes all day or day. And we're Gucci from there. So Terrakion's off the board here. And let's see what happens. What are you going to do, Ben? Hopefully waste a turn like leech seeding or something. Oh, big damage! Big damage! But there's a Giga Drain. He's going to get most of his health back. Ooh, maybe not, actually. Okay, so we've seen Giga Drain over Synthesis. That's unfortunate. That crit put him in a really bad position. Because now he dies, I think. That crit did big damage, dude. He withdraws. Who do you go into? You go into Vaporeon. No, you go into Comfe, who's poisoned. Okay, Comfe takes... 50 to 60% to this. Beautiful. And the poison could kill it. Oh, so close. Okay, so if he goes for a Giga Drain here, it'll do... It's fine. That's fine. The Giga Drain might kill me. It probably won't, though. Um. Ooh. Not sure what he went for. But Nitto King gonna take out Confei. I'm alright with that. And we're down to the last two Mons. A lot of bulk sitting on that team remaining. But I would have thought for sure he would have gone for Draining Kiss or something. Maybe even Giga Drain. Um, since he has priority with uh, whatever that ability is. All right, so we got Vaporeon here. First Nitto King. Scald obviously kills. But we're going to go for an EP. Um, I'll sack. We'll bring in Mega Manetric. And go from there. I think his last move is Protect. It should be Wish, Protect, Roar. He might roar me out here. He goes for the Scald. That'll kill. There goes Va uh, Nitto King. Nitto King dies to Vaporeon. Now we can bring in Mega Manetric. Do. And since T Bolt's not gonna miss, just throw that in there and save the overheat. <clears throat> All right, Mega Manetra kills Vaporeon. Down to one Mon, and it's a freaking 
Venusaur, dude. <laughs> Mega Venusaur is so bulky, it's ridiculous. All right. Let's see what you got for me. This sh should kill if it hits. If it hits, it's GG. If it's not, I'm going to need to hope Tornadus can finish it up with a U-turn combo. With, uh, or hit a hurricane. Because things are going to get dicey otherwise. So, overheat is... What kind of accuracy? 90%. 90% chance to win this game. Should be it. Right here. Right now. No! He lives! Are you serious? Oh my god. There's the Giga Drain. I live on 3 HP. Oh my god. Alright, so that cuts my special attack in half. Oh my god, this is so obnoxious. It's still better to go for another overheat than it is for me to swap out. That's fine. Oh my god. Leech Seed, stop it. Stop it right now. Okay. Thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> Mega Manetric, you're useless. Okay. Um, we're gonna go Tornadus. Let me look and make sure. Because, like, I want to make sure Heat Wave has a 90% chance. U-Turn is a 100% chance. U-Turn should kill. I mean, this is probably stupid of me. I should go for the 90% Heat Wave. I'm going to go for the Heat Wave. I don't want to take the risk. No! No, bro! I should have gone for the U-turn! Suicune should outspeed. And Scald this. <laughs> I should have just U-turned, man! Oh! If I lose this, I'm gonna cry. I will legit cry if I lose this. Okay, we got a little bit of extra health here. I need this to kill. This has to kill 100%. I cannot give him the chance. Please kill. Yes! Okay. Okay. Oh my god, dude. I almost... I almost threw that away. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Guys! Ladies and gentlemen, oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh. Wow, um, GG's to Ben, if you guys could be sure to check out his channel, that was way closer than it needed to be, but, but, the Drizzlers are now four and one, moving on up the leaderboard. Oh my god. Thank you all so much for watching, and until next week, peace out, you sexy, gorgeous, beautiful, wonderful gaming legends out there. Take care.